Hi, I am Karthik. Welcome back to my Mantak channel. In this video, I am going to uh, explain you how to set up Google Ads tag and uh, and set up conversion tracking of Google Ads with, for uh, with Go High Level Funnel. You can do the same setup with any uh, any funnels or any platforms you have like WordPress or Click Funnels or any platform you have. And the, um, basically the procedure would be same first you have set, you have to set up google ads tag and then you have to set up the google conversion action say if you are you are logging to the google uh, ads um, account you will see this kind of menu and just go to click tools and settings and click uh, setup and click google tag that's it once you are in the google tag you will have uh, you will see the page like this and uh, your google tag and it will show like the installation instructions just click the installation instruction it will show a prompt for two options whether like you can install with a website builder or the cms like the popular cms like wordpress Wix, or like any platforms uh, which google uh, makes it easy for you to set up or like you can install it manually just click the install manually copy this tag as it is and uh, if at all uh, you have a funnel um, this is a funnel uh, we have built uh, it's like uh, in the CRM called go high level just click and uh, then click settings and in the head tracking code you might have any code like uh, Facebook pixel code or anything you might have just cop uh, give a space and like enter into the head tracking code section just click save and you are good to go now if you go and uh, see you, you can also uh, troubleshoot or like whether everything is working fine with uh, with a chrome add-on called google tag assistant it's i changing it might get a new name and other things but for now you can see like google tag assistant is working and the same tag we have uh, we have entered it's firing correctly so this is how you can use like whether it's uh, it's the same tag for the re uh, remarketing also and uh, it's for the google site tag also this is the same tag you, you can see from the informations here this is the same tag we have uh, so this setup is completed without uh, any issue it's working fine and then we have to do the conversion action conversion is action is like when the customer actually match, makes a purchase this is like page view kind of thing uh, similar to the facebook pixel setup I mean, and the conversion tracking and then click tools and actions go to measurement and click conversions sorry click conversions you will see the list of conversions it's been set up you don't have to worry about that just click the new conversion action and uh, you will be shown like whether they it will ask for the uh, whether it's a website app or phone calls or input because we are using the uh, a funnel which is basically a website and just click website and uh, add the domain here it will scan whether the tags are already in place it will scan like you uh, it will show like the tags are already in place and then select a, it will ask for you to select the conversion goal conversion goal is like whether it's like a add to basket or like begin checkout or like a purchase thing or like submit lead form whichever the thing whichever it has multiple categories you can choose whichever one you like uh, let's uh, let's take it as submit url form and then let's we have to give not the opt-in page url you have to give the thank you page url which means like we are saying the google if the customer has visited visiting the thank you page you please uh, you may consider that as a successful uh, submit lead form google will uh, use those data and optimize your ads accordingly and then click add and now if you go and click like uh, a save and continue then the conversion tracking also will show it in the 
conversion tracking will immediately start and you can and the interesting thing is like you can uh, select uh, feed value for each value like you can feed whether this uh, lead value is uh, lead submission thing is how much it's a value and uh, you can let the uh, you can have different values for each conversion those kind of things and these are like attribution settings you don't have to, to worry about so this kind of uh, this uh, and um, once that is done your uh, add submit form um, is the uh, is the conversion action here and uh, then once that is done you can go uh, 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 click done and you have to manually install the conversion code just click the conversion code in case if you tell you like to manually install it uh, then you can install it uh, by grabbing the code from here sign ups click done click done and then click save and continue it will then show uh, give out the instructions to um, uh, set up the uh, tracking code since we have already set up the google tag perfectly you don't have to set up the thing you can just set up the events snippet just by uh, just click the events uh, snippet and it's a page load thing or the click thing since it's, we are using it for the thank you page there won't be any button associated with it just copy it and uh, in, you have to place it inside the head tag in the thank you page uh, this is like a this will be site wide or like the funnel wide thing and this tracking code but the snippet thing the success tra conversion tracking would be for specifically for the thank you page just go here settings tracking code header code just click save save now we have to test like whether the tracking is perfectly working whether there is no issue with the tracking thing just go again to the browser click enable the tag assistant thank you thank you page just click the thank you page now you can see like the conversion tracking there is earlier it was like only the google site tag and i had small remarketing tag now you can see that conversion tracking is also working fine so this is how you can set up the google uh, site tag remarketing tag and the conversion tracking within the go high level funnel this would be the same kind of setup for other funnels as well um, like click funnels are like most other platforms most other common platforms uh, mm. Uh, this would ensure that you uh, you track and optimize and google automatically optimizes your ads based on the conversion happening and also you could understand like oh, how much conversion is happening through the google ads also uh, this would be very helpful for measurement and analytics and uh, for the performance of the google ads and um, i hope this video is very helpful uh, let me know in case if you have any queries in the comment section i'll happy to answer that thanks for watching please consider subscribing channel bye